speaking of uh, bottled water, that it actually could be worse than tap water. Uh, or, or not as regulated, I think, is how, is how you put yeah, it. Yeah, the, the thing about tap water, no matter what you say about tap water, no matter what gets into tap water, it's still regulated. It's by law, of course, you know, if you're a city supplying hundreds of thousands of people mm -hmm. with water, you have to keep testing it. You're constantly, constantly testing it. And it is an imperfect thing, as we mentioned before. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's imperfect for lots of reasons. It's imperfect because all kinds of things get into water. If you think about what gets into a river, it's a lot of stuff, a lot of bad stuff. And uh, water treatment facilities can't take all that stuff out. They can kill pathogens, but they can't take synthetics out. Now, they're trying to figure out a way to re reverse engineer all these plants, but you've got to imagine this would be a tricky engineering thing. Mm -hmm. The trouble with bottled water is you're not, it's, first of all, it's unregulated, so who knows what kind of water they're putting in it. You've heard, everybody knows these old uh, stories that, that companies are just taking tap water and putting it in a bottle and selling it. The trouble with bottled water is it's not just the water inside, it's the bottle itself, mm -hmm. right? So again, if you test the water in a plastic water bottle, you can find traces of the plastic in the water. And it gets actually more worrisome when you're talking about uh, a liquid that you warm up. Mm -hmm. So this became a big story for mothers, particularly because, uh, or I should say parents with, with nursing children, when you wake up in the morning, say at 3 o'clock, and your baby is starving, and you take a bottle of breast milk and you put it on the stove top and you warm it up, mm -hmm. the plastic in the bottle can be leaching into the breast milk many times faster than it would at room temperature. So this is why one of the, one of the products that has been regulated recently after a lot of time of yelling and screaming is they've finally taken this chemical called bisphenol A mm -hmm. out of plastic baby bottles. Now that just seems to make common sense, but it took a long time to get people to wake up to that.